On October 7, 2024, a major milestone was achieved at General Dynamics Bath Iron Works with a future USS Patrick Gallagher, DDG-127, an Arleigh Burke-class guided missile destroyer, floating free from the dry dock for the very first time. This marks the beginning of the final phase of construction, signaling the ship's readiness to enter crucial stages of outfitting and testing. The operation to free the ship began late on Monday, under the full moon. Dry dock personnel worked through the night, guiding the massive vessel out of shipway one. As dawn broke on Tuesday, the dry dock was submerged in the river, filling its ballast tanks to release the ship from its cradle. Hours of precise maneuvering saw the Patrick Gallagher floating free, a seamless success for the team involved. Tugboats carefully maneuvered the destroyer into its designated position at Pier 2, marking the end of one chapter and the start of another. Now berthed at Pier 2, the ship will enter its final phase of construction, which will include the installation of critical systems, extensive trials, and necessary tests before it can join the U.S. Navy fleet. This phase is vital as it ensures the ship meets the U.S. Navy's rigorous operational standards. Building a ship like the USS Patrick Gallagher is a complex and highly coordinated process. It begins with a detailed design and planning phase, where architects and engineers create comprehensive blueprints that account for the ship's propulsion, weaponry, and advanced electronics. With design finalized, materials are sourced to meet the high demands of naval operations. The ship is then constructed using modular techniques, where separate sections are built, outfitted with systems, and then joined together to form the ship's hull. Following the hull assembly, the ship enters the outfitting phase, where the ship systems are integrated, including propulsion, electrical wiring, weaponry, and crew accommodations. This transformation turns the ship from a shell into a fully operational warship, ready for testing and trials. Now in open water, the USS Patrick Gallagher is set to undergo extensive trials. These tests will ensure the ship is fully operational before being handed over to the US Navy for service. The Arleigh Burke-class destroyers, known for their advanced capabilities, will soon add another formidable vessel to the U.S. Navy's fleet. With its completion, the USS Patrick Gallagher will be ready to take on missions ranging from missile defense to surface warfare and anti-submarine operations. This new addition to the fleet represents the U.S. Navy's continued commitment to maintaining a capable and advanced naval force, ensuring the protection of national interests across the globe.